it's all about process. You know, we probably didn't execute on our plans as well as um, we had in the previous game, but um, that's the nature of playing against a very, very strong team. You know, and credit to India for bouncing back real strong after the, the game before that. Um, that's exactly what you'd expect from a world leading team. So yeah, it's, it starts becoming mental now um, rather than physical. Our players are in a very good space. And so we're very hopeful tomorrow um, and we're very positive about tomorrow. Look, it's a, it's a possibility, but you know, traveling to India, India is always a wonderful tour and it's a, it's a great tour to, um, to judge yourself on as a player, as a coach. Um, and it's a great tour to let yourself know where exactly you're at with your cricket. You know it's going to be tough when you come here. I was very fortunate to tour here last year with Sri Lanka. Um, so I've had the experience before. Um, at the end of the day, we're all professionals. Uh, every time we walk out onto the field, you've got to make sure your routines are good. You've got to make sure your processes are good and you've got to, be, you've got to compete. So yeah, it's a possibility, um, but today's a great rest day for us. Um, and I'm, I'm, you know, our guys are professional. So tomorrow comes, we're, we're back on it. If I have special plans, which we do, I'm certainly not going to put them out in the media. <laughs> but having said that, you know, they're world-class cricketers, they're world-class. Um, you know, you, you can't go without mentioning guys like Shikadal and Royudu's on form. You know, you've got a lot of fantastic players. That's why India is such a strong team, you know. And as I said last year, as I'm saying again, they're a great team to learn from. You know, we don't just play against India, we learn from India too. So, um, you know, these are great opportunities when you come and play against um, teams of this quality. Look, Jason is a, is a world-class performer. Um, and you've seen that here. Uh, the way he leads, he leads by example on the field. He's a very, very good leader of this group. Um, he commands a lot of respect and he commands a high quality from this group. Um, and he's very, very well respected in the group. You know, his performances speak for themselves. As I said, he's a world-class performer and he's vitally important to this team. So, you know, we, we would want to have him on the field every day, 365 days of the year, 24 seven if we could. But as I said at the beginning, he's a human being, he's not a robot. Um, the, the, the one thing we don't have in the West Indies, which you do have in India and from uh, you know, England, Australia, is you've got depth. So you can rest players um, and you're gonna have real quality coming through behind them. Unfortunately, we're not in that place at the moment where we can just rest players when we want to, but we've got to be realistic as well. You know, Jason plays a lot of cricket um, and it's not just what he does on the field, you know, as a leader and as a captain, he's doing a lot of work off the field as well. Um, but certainly, you know, I love working with Jason. We have a fantastic relationship um, and long may that continue.